Welcome, welcome back to your boy Trouble Skills. Today we have a good one in the store as it is season 3 part 10 of the Chelsea Cream World on FIFA 23. Today though, with this banger, we play Liverpool, who I do expect to win. We play Arsenal in the Champions League after a 3 2 win with 10 men. Then we quit some Burnley, quit some City, play West Ham in the FA Cup final, quit some Bright Brighton up until we might win the Premier League, it'll be City, Brighton guys, or Bournemouth, so I'll be quick, I'll just be simulating one of them, jumping in for cuts and that's it, we're quick sim Bournemouth and that's it really, and nonetheless a press conference versus a team like Liverpool, what do I expect against the team like Liverpool, a win, they're second in the league, three points behind us, we have a game in hand, and I think it's the City game that equals that game. So, it's going to be an interesting one. I'm right, expecting nothing less than a win, honestly. Much. We should be banging this lot all over, easily, convincingly. But look at their team. They have Nunes, they have Gakpo, still got Salah, Silva, Sabozliai, Captain Jordan Henderson, Robertson, Christensen, and I didn't see the rest. But, well, you can pretty much just guess that it's a pretty good team. And that's just being pure honest. Well, it's Liverpool, they're going to have a good team. They probably won't have a massive fall off for a good, uh, well, for a good few years. But Jürgen Klopp's a magic worm. It, honestly, he is their best manager ever. And I'm saying this, don't, you can't even argue it. You just can't. What's anyone else ever done from that he had done? I need to know. He has won everything. And, and let me just re-say that. He's won everything as Liverpool manager. Club World Cup, Champions League, Premier League, Carabao Cup, FA Cup. Is there anything else that I'm missing? No, exactly. He's won everything there is to win, that's major. Because no one cares, right, if you offer someone out, Champions League or a Conference League or a Europa League, you're saying Champions League. So don't even talk about it. He even got him into a champ uh, not Champions League, well, he actually got him into multiple Champions League finals, but... Oh, what a save. Uh, but he's got them into a Europa League final. And I think they'll do the same this season. Apart from, I think they will end up winning it. It's Salah, it's 1-0. Oh, my God. And speaking of how good Klopp is, that man has just scored when I'm talking about how good he is. Um, Jürgen Klopp has just put Salah's career on the right path, I guess. He said if he kills, I don't think there is. Because... Salah, when he left Chelsea and went to Roma, he wasn't pulling up too many trees over in Rome. He was a good player, don't get me wrong, but he weren't pulling up too many trees. He's gone to Liverpool and he's been the best player in the world at times. That just says everything and it's Mulwani in his miss. Come on. I know it's another chance for Liverpool and it's going to be half time. Mike Megan. He hadn't had much to do with this half, but he really should be saving that Salah shot. He really should. He's in here post. He's, what, six foot five? Have it covered. In fact, he's six foot six. Have it covered, you big cunt. Both teams have a lot more to do in the second half as it gets underway. But here we go. No chance for Chelsea. For Dusov Lavic. And he... Oh, I thought that went in. Near post, man. See, Megan, that's how you do it. But it's Reese James. Pulls it back. Do so. Oh my god. Why is Alison Becker on? We're dominating. Fuck. Don't be a loss, I beg. Just beg, don't lose. Sat Max, my beautiful. Oh my god. Is this uh, Gouri? I think it is. Mudrick! Get in. Get in, you bastard. Yeah, you drink that tea, lad. Get in. Fucking get in, lad. This is the match that could easily win us the Premier League. Because we lose three to stay bare level points. All it takes for is to play Bournemouth and they've made up a goal difference. Yes, I did just take a slight dig at Bournemouth, but you know what, we we'll like those. It's one all full time. I'm disappointed, in all honesty. We are better than this. Uh, I know it's Liverpool, but fuck me. We were wank in that first half. 
Our finishing ability was awful. On the ball, we were absolutely fantastic. We were nearly perfect on the ball. It's just an product. Defensively, yes, we could have done a little bit better. But the goalkeeper by my and fight goal was awful. Let me shut up about that. Bigger and better games. Arsenal. Come to Stamford Bridge. The main question is, can Chelsea keep this lead at home versus a giant like Arsenal? Well, <laughs> there are many questions like that. And the easy and simple answer is, we don't know if we will. But what we do know is that these players on the pitch are going to give it their all. What we also know is that St. Dino, Vlahovic, Vinny Jr and Colin Mwani are here to tear up some arse. They're here to clean up their dinner. Arsenal get running lads. You better be quaking them boots. You bet ya. Oh, what is happening? What? Well, I, I do apologise. Uh, something just very weird that happened to my screen. Anyway, Megan just got a big glitch. Here's what it is. Right, corner. It's that Maxi man. Takes it short. Back to ASM. Gets it into the box. And it's defended away. W win seconds. Go on. Get the ball. Just twat a ball into the box. Go on. Oh, come on. Oh my god, it's gone in. Oh, is that Mawani? Oh, he's the goal. He is official with the goal. Second be behind the ASM, but he's an alien. Greatest of all time, don't compare to an alien, that's all I'm saying. Why do you think there ain't a goal in football there's only an alien, which is Lionel Messi? But he's been overtaken by Mawani right now. That is ridiculous. Ramsdale. Oh. That is awful. Wow. How much worse can you get? But in our second of three matches today, this is outstanding. <laughs> what a start. Ten minutes in, we're 4-2 up on aggregate in the Champions League semi. I'll take that. Here we go. What? Oh, my God. Was that more had playing as a battering man? Holy shit. But also, that finish was beautiful. Fuck. Ridiculous man, look at this, what a ball, oh that is beautiful, I'm not going to lie, what a finish, wow, Vlahovic, wow man, Ramsdale caught in no man's land again, also you have to sack that man, he's awful and we've got another chance for Dusan Vlahovic and he's going to take his shot and he's finally made the save, well done, only oh, took you 15 years. Go on, have it. Good clearance. Good clearance, but he, he's been their best player, have it, by a mile. On the ball, he's been pretty solid. Good runs, as you saw there. Just didn't come off from there. And I'm glad it didn't, because I don't. I can't stand him in FIFA. Go on, Sat makes a man. Oh, and it's 3-0, uh, but 6-2 on aggregate. 4-0 difference. 3 0 on the night, 6 2 on aggregate. What, what else can we ask for? Oh my god. The king of the Champions League is back. 100%. He's just back. Unreal. Fuck. Quality, quality, quality. Come on. Defend this. Come on. Oh, thank god. Thank god that hit crossbar. Oh my god, we're in. Vinny. Go on. Go on, you love it. And it's Camavinga winning us the, uh, what's it called, penalty, and he's not there. Did I say Vinicius Jr. and all? I don't think that. I saw that with Camavinga, I don't know. Maybe Camavinga went from red and Vinny came out of mouth, I have no idea. So that makes sense. And it's top bins, 5-0 five, uh, five difference. 7-2 in aggregate. Wow, Arsenal, get packing them bags and fuck off. Get out, lads. That is abysmal, man. Wow. Just quarter. Look at this. Top bin. Beautiful. Just... You love it, don't you? You just love it. Anyway, we're going to be making plenty of subs. Oh, you've seen those came off there. Uh,
I'm looking forward to this now. Bow over top, and it's perfect to do so. And Vlajevic is in, and it's going to be chipped, and it's 5 0. It's in. Finally. Finally, we've done it to Arsenal. Get in. That's them in the mud. Oh, Arsenal may have just got us our own Champions League like this. This could be the reason that we actually win the Champions League, because you've got to be in the final to win it. We all know this. You've got to be in it to win it. Arsenal out. Uh, they're not coming back from this. As you're about to see, full time, 5 0, into an aggregate. Where are Arsenal? Are they. Are they, are they out of the Champions League? Are they, are they six goals in aggregate behind? Ugh. Get out. Get out. Send your sins back to North London. You don't deserve to be in the West, wankers. Get in there. Fucking finally. Wow. I'm over Moonlight performance. Let's just say that. Perfect. Perfect. But... What more can I ask for, uh, ask for from this team? Quality. Well, oh, I did expect Vlajevic and Sat Maximan and Moani to score. But I also expected Vinny Jr. to score. I think he got a few assists, but I'm uh, not too happy. The obvious reason for him not scoring is just that we weren't focusing it down the side. But anyway, we beat Burnley 4 1. Vlajevic, Sat Maximan, Mendes, and Lozano get our four goals. We'll be taking that, and I don't have a clue who scored for them, it doesn't say. Anyway, it Chelsea versus Manchester City in the Premier League, I expect a win, and it's a one all draw through Kukurea, and Neon Korn gets their equaliser. Not good enough, not good enough at ZR. That is abysmal, that is absolutely shy. Okay, but anyway, everyone, better days are around. about to come upon us, I hope, as we play West Ham in the FA Cup final. Oh, can we win this? Ah, oh, I beg that we win. We just don't... I just don't see how we we'll lose. Well, it's something I didn't win with my West Ham team this. I will say that I wasn't good enough for a West Ham trophy, unfortunately. Well, uh, FA Cup trophy in my first career mode. Well, when we carried our cup first season, we went on to win Conference League for the same season. I won Europa League. Okay, guys, we're out of time, unfortunately. Uh, Thank Premier you for League, Premier League, Champions League, and I think that was it. I didn't win very much. I think I've won more in this career mode already, which is bonkers. Let's just put it up. Out there, well, straight out there like that. It is pretty damn bonkers. But we do take those. But here we go. West Ham make their way to the stadium. But they're just not going to be on our level. I guarantee you that. The levels to this game, and look, this lot just won't be on it. Guarantee you. Anyone up for a £10 bet? Obviously we don't bet, we are not idiots. Yeah, obviously we do, but still. Anyway, let me stop waffling. It is going to be a huge match, as, well, the West Ham team that nearly beat us, they came so close to beating us for the first time this season. I think we went a total of 40 Three games or something like that unbeaten, it was fucking outstanding. This lot deserve credit. It's not like 43 games undefeated, right, we kicked off for the final. But I don't know how we did it, man. It was unreal. And it's Moani, great. A straight goalkeeper. But we got a 2 draw against West Ham at Stamford Bridge, I think it was. Go on. Oh my god, he saved another. What the fuck? Kessie's been on 5 0, he's been our best attacking player. I'm not happy with that bit of on the ball, but we just need to pull finger out of it. Just in by a few inches, it's not good at all. But we've been better team by a mile. I guess that's a little bit biased, but we have, they haven't done that. I don't know if they've even had a shot, to be fair. I can't remember if they have. Second half is underway. Uh, come on. Come on, Mendes. Get a ball and... Oh, my God. He's got it. And it's fucking offside. That was a beautiful finish. I can't lie. That was outstanding. But he needs to bear. Camavinga and uh, Lozano are off. And on comes Vinny Jr. Anyway, Sam Maxwell. Go on, take that shot. Oh, he nearly scored too. 
That was nearly, nearly there. But they're here for taking, as you see. Go on. Go on. But look at this. And he's got pass in this Dulcon. His goal that was offside earlier is no longer offside here. We will be taking that. So far, so good by Chelsea. Home side look pretty damn informed. You can't argue with that. We have been miles better than this uh, West Ham team. Miles better than itself. I'm happy with it. We've got a goal. Should the, uh, should the other one have counted? Maybe, maybe not. We don't know. We haven't seen it back. Replays will tell us everything. But that's it. We've got our second trophy of season. It's a major one. It's one of the biggest trophies in England. Well, second biggest. Premier League obviously being bigger. FA Cup's always going to be second. Always. But what a night. That is back to back to back. Champ uh, not Champions League, uh, FA Cups, obviously it was a Champions League, but can we do back to back to back Premier League, and can we win our first Champions League, that'll be next time out though, but the Premier League, we might do it to, it would go though, it's a big trophy to win, it's a huge trophy in fact, wow, it's back to back to back for FA Cups as I've said, quality, the skipper is currently walking up to the trophy. Alan St. Dino, take a bow. What season he's had, by the way. Our front four has been quality. And there we go. Love it. Absolutely stunning. Then blue ribbons suit that trophy. Wow. Absolutely brilliant by us. Can anyone deny the fact that we've been unbelievable throughout this season? Because I think, without a doubt, we've been the best team in the world. Probably the consistency was shown. And last year we were best team in world. I don't care what anyone says whether we got knocked out of Champions League by PSG and it was embarrassing or not. I don't care. I don't care at all. It was absolutely shit what happened to us in Champions League last year. But we went undefeated in Premier League. Way more impressive than way Arsenal did it. We won the FA Cup too. Like what more is it to add? Apart from the obvious Champions League. But it was a bit annoying, I guess, what happened. What? Why is everyone tea posing? Anyway, enough of tea posing. We are here. We are here. The photo day is upon us. But everyone deserves credit. Everyone deserves a bonus. Fair play. On to the Brighton match. This game will win us the league if even if we lose, so I'm not too forced. I'd like to get a win. Come on, man. Don't do this. Defend. Come on, well done. It's a counter-attack. Come on. Get the ball in back of their net. There we go. Vinicius Jr. Get in there, lad. But anyway, this will win us the league. Get on with trophy celebrations. We've deserved it. We've just deserved this. Not many teams in the history of football were, are capable of doing what we've just done. We've absolutely shut everyone up. No two ways about it. Everyone just shut up. You can't at us. We are currently treble winners in Premier League, Community Shield and FA Cup. Can we become quadruple winners? That's a real question. But imagine if we do that. Un-fucking real that will be. Oh man, don't get excited. Don't get excited. It's not legal on these parts, so I'll have you know that. Anyway, look at that trophy. It looks nice, doesn't it? It looks absolutely stunning. Look at it. Look at how everyone's just so happy. Smile on everyone's face. You look around, smile. Look there, smile. You look there, smile. And another smile. It's happy days. And the fans. Everything to be thankful for here. Travelling all these miles. Todd Bowley, you know, he has to be happy right now. But, you know what I'm saying, Todd, hi me. Hi me, Todd Bowley. I'm the one. This uh, Mauricio Pochettino, Don, looks shy. 
But you lost 3 1 to West Ham a few weeks ago. So, what's that say? I'm better. I've beat them in the FA Cup final, that's all I say. Anyway, St. Dean, you'll lift up the trophy and you'll love to see it. The number 10 has landed on London. In fact, it landed, it felt like it, a million years ago. But it's just been an unbelievable signing. It, it's all it's best signing of every career, man. I'm not even kidding. I don't even mean him to. I play it, I try and attack down the left as much as I can. Because that's normally where my most PC side is. Alfonso Davies and Sat Maxman in my West Ham career mode. Del Console and Sat Maxman in my Hanover career mode. And who's the left back in my Inter Milan one? Oh, that's going to annoy me. But I think actually main tomorrow, that's the only one where I've attacked down right because I had that uh, Denzel Dumfries and Messi, so I tried attacking that. But anyway, it's 2 all. Oh, Bournemouth. It's Dango and Vinny Jr. That, that's how it. They last two goals. So Max Man got our goal, and B Ballerina got their goal. So 2 all draw because they're players. We end the day. Obviously, winning league. The three teams relegated Bristol, Palace, and Leeds. See you later. Have a good one, eh? Ha, enjoy the championship, losers. Anyway, it's been your boy for now. Take care and peace. I've enjoyed this one a lot.